guys, today we're gonna check out this Ohana in Hawaii set, and this is a super cute set featuring Lilo and Stitch, and I love that they've started coming out with these play sets, these Zoom Zoom play sets, and it has a little house in there, it's got a little tree swing for her to swing in, the hammock, and even Stitch in a little car. So we're gonna open this up today and look at all the pieces. It comes with 19 pieces and a number of accessories down here that you can play with with the Zoom Zooms. I think that this has been long overdue, so the kids can actually play with the Zoom Zooms because I know that my kids have really always loved these little toys, but it seems like they wanted to put them into a play set and play with things. So we've seen this one and then also an Alice in Wonderland and an Aladdin So one. here is everything that's in this set and then there's also down here the Down the Rabbit Hole Alice in Wonderland set, which looks really cool. It's got like a swing that goes over from the house up to the little tree area and then also the Aladdin one has the Agrabah Palace and then also has the tiger from that movie. So these are really cool and I'm hoping that we can get them all. So let's go ahead and open this up and you can see that it has plastic here that just pops. So we're just going to lift this right off the top. I love that it's easy to get into too. So the first one we're going to take out is Stitch. He's one of my girl's favorites. We absolutely love the breakfast at Ohana at Disney World. So Stitch is in his little car and you can see that he's got a little superhero cape on. I love it. Look at how cute that is. So this cape is removable as well. So there is Stitch up close and personal. And he's one of the smaller Zoom Zooms. And then you can put his little cape on as well, which I love that they have the accessories to accessorize them. So it also comes with this house. Let's see if we can get this whole house out of there. We'll see if we can get Lilo so she doesn't just fall. But this is all really stuck in there. So there is Lilo, and you can see that she's all sparkly. I love her sparkles. She's shimmery and sparkly. And she is one of my girl's favorites as well. She's so sweet. So we're gonna try to get this house out. Whoop, the palm tree comes off. It's okay, it's not broken. I have some scissors over here. Some scissors definitely help. So there's the house, and then this is just a little plastic insert, so we're going to pop that out. So you can see the little playhouse, and on the inside, it's just the red plastic, so there's no details on the inside of it. The outside is cutely detailed and has the little shutters around the house, and it has an area here at the top where Stitch will fit in right there, and he can come peeking out from the house. So then we're going to get the rest of the pieces out here. So. We're gonna use the scissors for this as well. So there's the two palm trees. Then the other figure is Lilo's little doll. This is one of the smaller ones as well. So you can see the size next to Lilo is perfectly sized. And it's got the cute little hair detail and you can stack them up as well. So that's what those look like. And then it comes with the little wagon. So if you've seen Lilo and Stitch, the little wagon with the record player, you know that Lilo is very into Elvis. So it's one of my favorite parts about the movie. So you can use those in the playset as well. Then down here are all the accessories and you can accessorize your figures. So here in the small pieces, there's even a little cardboard surfboard back there. There is a small ice cream cone. And you can actually stick this over one of the characters. So you can see you can accessorize that on a character. It's also got some sunglasses. And then those will fit on Lilo, just like this. How cute she is. There is also the little ukulele, and this also fits over the character. 
There is a shell charm. There's the surfboard that was the cutout that was behind the different accessories. Over the smaller ones, there's a grass skirt. And there is another charm. So this charm, I believe, pops off. So you can either have the flower or the shell on this one. So I actually really love this low cardboard piece. So I just went ahead and put this behind because it kind of helps set the scene behind your play set. And so I have Lilo decked out with her sunglasses and a little charm here. You can set her on the hammock between the two palm trees. And then there's Stitch. I'm going to put the ukulele around him. I always love ukulele Stitch. I have one of the little plush characters that has that as well. So you can set the characters on the top. Then there's Scrump. And I think that her little doll is so cute. You can attach this to the wagon and it fits nicely right there. And this is removable. So you can take that out and pretend you're rolling those around. And if you want to turn the playhouse around, you can play with them on two different levels on the inside. And I think this is also really cute because they've thought of the detail where they can look out the windows. So you can have them where they're looking out the windows here in the front as well. So we're going to put Stitch just peeking out right there. So there's Stitch peeking out the window of the house. And then the palm trees, we're still working out over here. So this is what they look like from the back. They're just hollow. And so they're not the most stable, but you can, if you see this piece right here, it does hook in to this play set. So that's going to give it some more stability. So they will work on their own. But it makes it more stable when you connect everything together like that and use it all as one piece. And then that way she can sit right here and it just balances a little bit better. So let's put one of the smaller ones on there. So all in all, I'm really loving these sets. I love all the little accessories that they have go along with the different characters. And I think a lot of thought was put into these as far as their personalities and the different items that would be best to put in the play set. And I love that it is functional. Like the kids can actually use their little Simpsons now. And they can, you know, pretend play with them and interact with them. Because I do think that that was the one thing that was missing before. So these little play sets, we found ours at Target and it was only $14.99. And that's the other thing is that we have so many of these little figurines and the girls love collecting them. But it was like, what do they do with them after they collect them? Well, now they can play with them in these little play sets. And I feel like the price is really reasonable for all the different pieces that you get. And I would prefer to get these play sets over even just like a single Zoom Zoom mystery pack. Even though this is a little bit more expensive, I feel like they can do more things. You know, they can pretend play and you know, really use their imagination with these. So I think that we're going to get a lot of use out of these and I hope that they really love this one because then we can go try out the Alice in Wonderland one and the Aladdin one. I especially really like the Alice in Wonderland one. I thought it was bright and fun. And then being a kid from the 90s era, from the Aladdin era, I really love that they included the tiger in that one from the sand scene and then the palace looked really neat as well. So this is the Ohana in Hawaii set, and this is new. We found this at Target. Hopefully you guys enjoyed checking out our review. Make sure to leave a like and comment down below. We would love to hear from you and hear what toys you would love to see reviewed on our channel. And we have a lot of videos coming up for you guys, some new doll videos and some fun Disney videos. So be sure to check out those as well. So that's it for today. Thanks so much for watching, and have a great day.